Hello everyone! Today I will show the best free to play games on Nintendo Switch. All of these games are completely free, and you can download them from Nintendo eShop right now. Realm Royal is a free to play third person shooter where 90 players battle it out for victory. Colorful and funny online game where in the squad play mode, knockdown players turn into chickens. Warface is a free online FPS game with 5 player scope, lots of PvP mods and interesting PvE missions. The game is developed by Crytek and is based on the CryEngine tree used in the Crazy series. Super Kirby Clash is a free multiplayer action game for kids, where you can choose from 4 unique roles and join up to 3 other players to defeat powerful bosses. Puff up your power by crafting weapons and spending materials at the shop to receive even more weapons. World of Tanks Blitz is an action-packed MMO with PvP tank battles. Fight 7 with 7 alone or with friends. Upgrade armored vehicles and use various tactics from aggressive onslaught to stealthy survival. Fantasy Strike is a free multiplayer fighting video game. The game is designed to be less complex than traditional fighting games. Having dedicated buttons for every action, including mail, jump, throw, special moves and a super move, each player picks a character to play, which are then placed in an arena. Whoever is the first to win for out of 7 rounds is given the match win. Ninjala is an online action battle game, featuring ninja and guns. Use ninja gun to blow bubbles that can be tossed at your foes, craft all sorts of weapons and dash across stages. The appearance and rarity of your weapon will vary depending on the type of ninja gun you use. DC Universe Online is a free-to-play action combat massively multiplayer online game set in the fictional universe of DC Comics. Create your own superhero or supervillain in DC Universe Online and beat the shit out of the bad guys. Vigor is a free-to-play survival looter shooter in post-war Norway. The goal is to stay alive and upgrade an abandoned shelter that will protect the player against the harsh environment. Fallout Shelter is a F2P construction and management simulation video game. The player will manage the Vault Tech Operation Bunker as an overseer. To advance throughout the simulation, one needs to increase the size of the wall by adding and upgrading new rooms, each with their own function, and then adding dwellers to run each room. Pac-Man 99 is a maze battle royal video game for up to 99 players at the same time. Players control Pac-Man throughout on enclosed maze, eating dots on the board and evading colored ghosts that pursue them. Eating power pellets causes the ghosts to turn blue and become edible. Eating ghosts send enemies called Jamie Pac-Man to another opponent in an attempt to slow them down and eliminate them from the game. The game is a Nintendo Switch Online exclusive. Roller Champions is a competitive multiplayer sports video game from a third person perspective. As a Royal Champion, complete in a team of 3 against 3. The rules are simple take the ball, make a lap while maintaining team possession, dodge opponents, and score. Go for more points by completing additional laps before attempting a goal. After each match, gain pains to compete in bigger arenas, customize characters, and create a unique destiny. Cousin Royal is a brutal multiplayer last man standing shooter with realistic weaponry, mystic traps, and demonic rituals. The game puts several dozens of players on the map, surrounded by a shrinking ring of dead, and makes them fight each other until there is only one standing. It's possible to play solo, duo, or in a team consisting of up to 5 players. Unlike other Battle Royale games, there is no parachuting phase, and players are spawned randomly all across the map right after matchmaking is finished. Omega Strikers is a new free-to-play action sport video game. The game features short, 3-on-3 free -on -free online multiplayer matches, in which players compete to score more goals than the opposing team. Players can choose from a cast of characters known as Strikers. Each Striker has a unique set of abilities, which can be used to attack enemy players. Move the core, buff your allies, debuff your enemies, and more. When a character takes damage, the stagger bar increases, which makes it easier for the opponents to knock them back or even off the field entirely for a short duration. The Elder Scrolls Blades is a spin-off of the Elder Scrolls series, set following Oblivion and preceding Skyrim. Blades features three main game modes – Abyss, Arena and Town. Abyss offers a roguelike experience in which the player must attempt to get as far as possible in an endless dungeon. 
Arena is player vs player multiplayer mode, in which two players battle against each other. Town is a game's main mode, which is a hub area where the player can receive quests and meet one player characters to progress story. The player's hub town initially starts destroyed, and they are tasked with rebuilding and upgrading it, which consequently unlocks more quests and NPCs. Smite is a third-person multiplayer online battle action game, where players control a god, goddess or other mythological figure. Unlike other mobiles, Smite takes you straight to the battlefield from a third-person perspective. Apex Legends is a free-to-play battle royale game with many memorable heroes, each of which has its own unique abilities, and is able to change the course of the battle. The game supports cross-platform play. Skyforge is a massively multiplayer online action RPG, inspired by science fiction and fantasy. In Skyforge, players assume the role of an immortal hero with incredible celestial powers, who must protect the planet alien from invaders who threaten the world and its population. Session-based gameplay makes it easy to play while traveling on your lunch break or kicking back at home. Rocket League is a high-powered hybrid of arcade-style soccer and vehicular mayhem with easy-to-understand controls. Use rocket power cars to kick the ball into the opponent's goal and score points during the match. The game includes single-player and multiplayer modes that can be played both locally and online. Also, this game supports cross-platform play. Arena of Valor is a mobile MOBA game developed by Tencent Games, the same company behind the popular PC MOBA League of Legends. The game is a streamlined version of its PC counterpart, designed to appeal of the mobile gaming audience. Arena of Valor features 5 vs 5 battles and variety of characters, each with their own unique abilities. Players must work together to capture objectives and defeat the enemy team, while also defending their own base. Tetris 99 is an innovative battle royale style puzzle video game, exclusive to subscribes of Nintendo Switch Online. In each match, 99 players are pitted against one another, attempting to be the last player standing with an unoverflowed board. To gain an advantage, players can clear a row on their own board, sending extra rows to the other players. Super Animal Royale is a top-down team battle royale game, where cute animals fight for dominance. Players must scavenge for weapons and resources to survive, build defense fortifications, and battle to be the last one standing. Featuring a unique art style, charming characters, and intensive combat, Super Animal Royale is sure to provide a wild and exciting experience. Dauntless is a free-to-play, action royal playing video game. Dauntless is set in a fantasy setting, where a cataclysm event has torn the port apart releasing monstrous creatures known as behemoths that prey on human survivors. Players take on the role of exterminators, who destroy behemoths and collect loot from them, which they use to create more powerful equipment. Brawlhalla is a free-to-play fighting game with full crossplay across all platform. In most of Brawlhalla's game modes, the goal is to knock one's opponent into one of four areas outside of the visual boundaries of the map, referred to as Blood Zones similar to Super Smash Bros. Sky Children of the Light is an open-world social indie adventure game from the creators of Journey. In Sky, players explore a once prosperous kingdom using a cave that allows them to fly. The in-game war consists of seven unique realms, each with a variety of areas to explore and them representing different stages of life. The game places heavy focus on social mechanics. Players are able to meet and befriend one another and can unlock new abilities, such as chat and sending gifts as their friendship grows. Warframe is an online action game that includes elements of shooter, RPG and stealth. In Warframe, players control members of the Tenno, a race of ancient warriors who have awoken from centuries of suspended animation far into its future. The Tenno use their powered Warframes, along with variety of weapons and abilities, to complete missions. Pokemon Unite is a multiplayer online battle arena video game, with standard match consisting of two teams, each with five players. Each match is limited to 10 minutes in duration. 
Pokemon Unite is unique from other MOBAs due to the fact that there is no in-game scoreboard. To prevent players from leaving the game out of frustration when they are losing in score. Asphalt 9 Legends is a free-to-play racing game. There are currently 207 cars in the game. Each of the cars belongs to a class progressively featuring higher performance and rarity. In the game there are 5 race modes – Career, Multiplayer, Club, Daily and Seasonal Events. Overwatch 2 is a first-person hero shooter game, where players are split into two teams and select a hero from a roster of 35 characters. Overwatch 2 was released as free-to-play as opposed to the premium monetization model of its predecessor. It also discontinued loot boxes in favor of a battle pass system. Fall Guys is a unique battle royal. The game involves up to 60 players who control jelly bean like characters and compete against each other in a series of randomly selected minigames. Fortnite is a battle royal game where 100 players compete against each other to be the last one standing. Players must scavenge for weapons and resources, build defensive structures and eliminate opponents in order to survive. The game has become a global phenomenon, with an audience of several million players around the world.